it's the end of the world. Of the <laughs> <laughs> it's really <laughs> sad. Hey, more you notice. 12 Very years. Morbid. Now, yeah. who's going to cry today? Is someone going to cry today? <laughs> <laughs> Kayla, you're going to cry? 100%. Yeah. Have you been, who's been crying? Because you have, what, nine episodes left? Yeah. Nine left. Okay. I didn't know we weren't coming back until. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> what a way to find out. Yeah. He's bringing Nightmare. you here. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> it's great to be here. Yeah. <laughs> no, that, so is it like getting emotional, like with, with every episode that you shoot? Sure. Yes. Yeah, I think so. We've been getting super emotional. We were doing a scene before the holiday, and we, we were just blocking. And we we're the only two in it, and just kind of rehearsing the scene. And out of nowhere, I just started bawling. Yeah. And the crew, all the camera guys and everyone came out. They're like, we're so glad you cried, because we've been waiting to cry. And then they all gave us <laughs> this huge group hug. hug. Mm. And like we just all cried for like 10 minutes. See, I haven't cried yet. And <laughs> I have a very deep fear, seriously, that I'm going to, the most apart. unexpected thing is going to happen. I'm going to absolutely yeah. lose my I mean, yeah. you know, yeah. and I'm like, I, we're all scared I, of that because it really is profound the amount of time of your life, and it's like more than I think any of us can get a grip on. And I'm worried something's going to trigger me like deep down. It's like, oh, I didn't That's, know that was there. Yeah. Oh, that hurts, you know. Yeah. yeah. Should well, we just get it out of the way? Yeah. Right now? Why don't no. Why don't we do it right now? Let's just cry right now. We can all cry. Ready? One, you guys want to give us a big two. hug and we'll just start crying? Yeah, yeah. just start crying now. Anyone hugs me about it, I start crying. So yeah. it just starts. Happening. It still feels feels very hypothetical. I feel I think come. Like the end of this coming summer, when we're when we would generally be That's meant to true. come back, yeah. is yeah. Yeah. a little real. When we'll be unemployed, we'll really be <laughs> crying. Then <laughs> <laughs> we'll really be yeah. crying. Yeah. Not working. Yeah. yeah. In the I, unemployment I, line, I don't is where think we all that's break. Happen. <laughs> but I mean, 12 years is a really long relationship. Long I mean, even though you have breaks, right. it's like you're spending 12 years with someone and you've grown so much together. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you were how old were you when you you were the youngest? I just turned 21 when we started. Right. Yeah. You what? couldn't drink, right, during the pilot? I couldn't drink during she the pilot. She couldn't, but she did. She was allowed. She was allowed. They taught me how. Aren't you proud of that? Yeah. <laughs> when we I end, learned so much. she will still be a year younger than I was when we started. Hmm. Wow. She can do another 12-year sitcom. Me. Yeah. I'm like, really? It is. No, it's no. been a long, You a have long my road. whole life ahead of you. <laughs> <laughs> now, are you, I mean, Simon, you still look, you still look exactly the same. You have not changed at all. I but really if, do. if you look at the picture of the first season, <laughs> <laughs> oh I wish, oh, see, I no. wish I looked different. No way! You, you look like Jennifer. You look exactly the same. It's all fake. This is all. Uh, <laughs> That's so irritating. No, it's no, it's, you look exactly the you, same. It, it yeah. is annoying that I look Don't the same. Show no. Don't jealous. show any other pictures. Don't show any other pictures. I'm going to show all of you because oh, well, I mean, you want to see all of you. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my goodness! Oh. Wow. Oh, someone goodness. went heavy with the tanner that season. <laughs> Look at that. Mayim, you didn't even know, when you joined, uh, you didn't know the show I had never seen The Big Bang Theory. I thought it was a game show. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you won! Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, someone had told me that in some season of The Big Bang Theory, they mentioned that the girl from Blossom is a scientist. Yeah. So when someone told me that, I thought, oh, like, it must be a game show, like a trivia thing. I had no idea that it was a very popular sitcom, apparently. Right. <laughs> so, I mean, somebody must have said it's not a game show before you signed on. <laughs> well, my manager said they are looking for a female Sheldon Cooper, and I said, who's Sheldon Cooper? When she auditioned, she, she kept buzzing in, but they still... <laughs> Gave it to her, which was really generous. <laughs> <laughs> no whammies. <laughs> what? You know, yeah. So your your first impression when you were what, what what did you first of all did all of you know or feel that you had something that was going to go this long? And then Kunal, what what did you feel the first? What were your impressions of everyone? Um. Wow, I've been waiting a long time to say this, but uh, oh, wow. I, <laughs> no, no. But I mean, the only thing I remember is seeing you and think because on his IMDb page he was listed as six three, and I remember seeing I, Simon, I was six three when IMDb came and out. And I remember seeing Simon <laughs> and being like, "Wow, you are not as tall as I thought you were uh, going to be." <laughs> And uh, that's why we're still <laughs> such good friends to this day. The cybersecurity on IMDb has really gotten <laughs> much more intense since yeah. they, they began. But yeah, I was I was such a kid when I started too. So I think when we started, just didn't you don't ever think it, anything like this is going to happen. happen. No, yeah. And I think what's so kind of sweet is even after all these years, and, and really up to recently, we still talk about. We come in, we're like, oh my god, how well did the show do? Well, last night, really, they watched that person. Know? And we kept that for so long. We never just kind of said, oh, we're we're all good now. Melissa, you're pregnant on the show. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I feel like I was pregnant for like 900 years, <laughs> which might be a, a real medical thing, because I was 
pregnant on the show, then I was pregnant in real life, and then pregnant on the show again. So I was always wearing some form of bump <laughs> to the point where like I don't know where to put my hands anymore because they were just resting on the belly for so long. So now I'm like, I get it was confusing to us too. We yeah, there was a lot of. Yeah. We didn't know whether to say congratulations or ooh, lay yeah, off the dessert. There was a lot of times like Penelope would be like, Are you wearing the bump? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes, I'm wearing the bump. Yeah. <laughs> and congratulations, you just won a People's Choice Awards for. Uh, favorite. Thank you. As did you. Yes. Did you have fun? It was wonder. Oh yeah, there we are. Yeah, there you Touching are. Touching our crystal. Um, uh, I had a wonderful time. I was very excited when I saw you. You were mm -hmm. like first thing out of the right. gate. Right. Yep. And um, and people coming in. It was. It, it, you'll. I will never go. I don't. I'm not a musician or anything. I'll never be at the Grammys. And you're walking in. It's like Carrie Underwood walked in, whose name I could not remember. I'm like, is that Jesus take the wheel? And they're like, yes. And <laughs> and um, Mariah Carey came in and. Um, it, what was funny was that they ushered Mariah in, and I heard them, I guess it was seat fillers, is that what they said? Yeah, yeah. Seat, until the stars get in the Until seat, the stars yeah. get in, they have other people sitting there, and they're like, you need to get out, you're in Mariah's seats, blah, blah, blah. And so some people are moving, but some I hear going, but no, I'm supposed to be sitting here. And I thought, oh, what if that had been me? And I thought, I would totally leave if they'd let me kneel at her uh, beside her. I was uh -huh. so taken with her when she got there. Uh, was she near you? Right behind me, literally. Wow. If, in fact, there was, there was a lot of YouTube footage of her getting up, and um, you could always see me looking. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It took it's a while weird. for her to get up, I think, right? Well, there was a problem. It did. I did a lot of clapping, and, and there's YouTube footage of me going uh, as she walks uh, by. Uh, it's very awkward, but she's uh, just in her loveliness, just beautiful. You seem genuinely enthralled with the, the whole. Where are you from? Texas, Houston. Uh, Houston, Texas. Mm -hmm. And are your, your family still there? My family is still oh, there. They must be so proud. They're, they're quite excited. Uh -huh. They really are. They're, they always get together and like have dinner and watch the show. My sister and my mother and my sister's husband and her kids. And huh. they'll call after it. Until, and sometimes they don't, which is so <laughs> weird. It would be like if your mother, does your mother call every day after the show? No, she's usually here. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Is she yeah. here today? No. Oh. No. <laughs> But, but she doesn't call me every day. Uh, well, okay, but if she did and she suddenly didn't, wouldn't you think like, oh, something didn't sit right with mother in the show today? Yes. That's so what, I think that, and right. that, but there's never anything wrong. They, they just, just like, ran out of time. Just sometimes don't call you. Yeah. Yeah. It's a little awkward though. Yeah. That, that's why they got together was to watch the show I'm on. Right. And, and then to break up the regularity of the... Tell them to call you every day. I call me every day. Good. They, look. <laughs> This is the way to do it. This is the forum for you. How we've reversed. It used to be mother that was telling me call every day. Right. And now I'm begging her. Begging your mother An to call. Old you. lady, please. She's not yeah. that old. I'm sorry. I did not mean yeah. that. I really didn't mean that. I don't know yeah. why I said that even. That's, congratulations on the uh, star on the Walk of Fame. Thank you. We're so emotional oh, about that. I know. Like, like, I was like crying the whole time. I'm not. I'm not a crier. I, 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 every picture that's taken, I'm crying. Like, was just so exhausted. <laughs> she was like it was a funeral or something. The worst. Ex that's a lovely, another wow. lovely expression. Yeah, you've caught some golden, golden pictures. I got so emotional that day when I woke up in the morning. They had told me over a year ago, so long ago, and, I, and then they didn't call me again. And I thought they probably didn't mean they to call me. They changed their mind. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. That was, they were meant like <laughs> someone else. And then they call me, they're like, it's like, next week, we're doing it. And that morning I woke up, I was so overwhelmed. I, it was just, it wasn't even a dream I had ever had, you know? Yeah. Like, and then they put me near John Ritter, and you know my relationship with him, and that was like, I just kept bawling. I mean, someone was like, do you want a coffee? And I would just cry. Like, it just, <laughs> anything that you said to me, it was just emotional. Oh. It was really cool, yeah. Well, that's, it is, especially near John Ritter's star. That was amazing. That, yeah, It just amazing. felt, it was really amazing. Well, congratulations. Thank Life you. Life is going very well for you. Well, Hi. welcome to the show. This is your Thank very you. first time My on? very first time. Oh, Graham. It is. I'm so excited, I can't even tell you. I'm such a huge fan and have been for years. I'm, I'm sort of freaking out right now. I'm very, I'm just so thrilled to be here. I had a VHS tape of you on Carson that I would play over and over again. How old were you? I was about seven and I, I was obsessed with comedy as a kid. I was a weird kid who didn't go outside ever. And I would just stay inside and watch comedy and my parents knew that I loved watching stand up so they would tape late night shows for me and um, I had your Carson tape and I wore it out and I memorized your um, phone call to God bit is one of my, fa it's the best stand up routine of all time. It is, it's, it really is incredible. Thank you. And I, yeah. So phone call to God, that is a seven year old to get that. And then I know you did stand up 
did you, like, as a kid, did you do that routine? I, d I memorized it, and I, I did it for show and tell. And I, I wish I could say I did you proud, but the kid before me had, like, a shark tooth that he brought in from the Bahamas that really killed. But, and I, it, it was a hard act to follow. And then I, I did your bit, but I was taking those great comedic pauses that you had while you're waiting on the line, and I just had this room full of second graders staring at me. <laughs> and I also went in and I said, like, it's Ellen, Ellen DeGeneres. And they're like, who is she? Why is she? Why is she? <laughs> That's not her name? <laughs> yeah. But anyway, I'm just so thrilled to well, be here. Well, first of all, thank, thank you. you very much. And I, I tell you, for a long time before I did that on Carson, uh, I had a room full of adults that didn't listen to those pauses either. Oh. So it took a long time for people to, to let me have those long pauses. But for a seven-year-old, that's really uh, impressive oh. that you actually grasp that concept. So I'm, I, I'm impressed by wow. you. And now you're on Big Bang Theory, which is so impressive. I mean, I mean, and I know that everybody gets along and everybody, it's a great set, right? You it's a dream. Yeah. It is a dream. And I came into the show later and they all couldn't have been more welcoming. It's yeah. just such a huge family and I love it. And, yeah. And we're right on the lot, right by yeah. you. And they have, um, they, there's all these, you know, beautiful posters outside of all the shows. And I was so excited when, um, when I was on the poster and I brought my parents by the lot to show them when they came to visit. And I was like, look to your right. And they just went, Ellen! <laughs> they were so, so excited. And we drove by again. They're like, oh, there, there you are. Too. There you are. <laughs> yeah. No, that's a cool, I love that poster they put up of y'all. I think that's really cool. Um, that's funny that your family did that. Hi, Mayim, how are you? Oh, hi. hi. It's good to see you, and it's great y'all are working together again after Big Bang. How did this come about? Um, well, Jim um, came to me. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> no, no, you, you can say it. I came to you while on set Jim, one day. Jim came to me and he said, I want to know what you think about this project that my company has. It's this Miranda show. It was really popular on the BBC. And so I went home, I did a little research, and I came back the next day and I said, well, Jim, that seems like a really awesome project. Good luck. I, you got my vote of confidence. And he said, no, I'm asking because I want you to be in it. And I was shocked because I think I'm very annoying. But however annoying I am, he obviously still wanted to work with me. Yes, Jim? I think, you're, I think that the annoying quality you bring is what America responds to, Maya. I think that's what this character wanted. Right, that's very relatable. Everyone, love, we know someone annoying, so that's, that's <laughs> perfect. So you're filming the last season, the final season of Big Bang. How is that feeling? Uh, it's, it's, it's gonna be okay. It's, um, <laughs> it's, it's gonna be okay. It's bittersweet, you know. Um, I'm still trying to process all of it because it's been such a big part of my life, obviously. It's given me all the blessings in the world. Um, right now, I'm just showing up on time, focused on working, and then... I think when I come back from Christmas, the countdown will begin. We'll only have 11 more to shoot. And you get this, the series finale, uh, the day we shoot it is April 30th. Uh, not the day it airs, the day we shoot it. It's actually my birthday. Wow. So it's almost like the character I was born to play is the day that I don't get to play it anymore. There's some kind <laughs> yeah. of something that, I yeah. don't know, if I had a beard, it would make sense. Yes. Yeah, yeah exactly. That's amazing. That's Isn't really that cool? amazing. Yeah, oh, that's life very comes cool. full circle, man. Yeah. Wow. That's amazing. Um, and that is the longest running uh, sitcom ever. Yes, ever. it'll be the longest running, 279 episodes. What a dream. Yeah. All right? Good Can't for you. Be. And thank you for everything for that you. you've done. You're a great inspiration. Well, it's just the coffee mug. Yeah, exactly. Um, <laughs> All right, we're going to take a break, and then we will play a game after this. All right, so we've split you guys into two teams, boys versus girls. I'm going to take turns asking each team a trivia question. As soon as I'm done, the balloon in front of you will start filling up. When you know the answer, press that button to stop the balloon from filling. If you get the answer wrong, the balloon will keep filling up. If nobody on the team knows, you get three-second penalty, and it goes to the other team. Okay. All right. First team whose balloon pops is the loser. Got it. All right. Mm. Got it. So as soon as you know the question, girls, I'm starting with you. All right. <laughs> Who are the two teams playing in the Super Bowl this weekend? The Patriots and the Rams. That's right. <laughs> Good job! Now you can see how that's going to... Yeah. you. Yeah. Uh, All right, bad. boys. Who is the oldest Kardashian sister? <laughs> Uh, Courtney. Yes. He was oh, Courtney. I didn't know that. Okay, good. I would have oh, said no. all knows yeah. that. That's great. Woo, so all right, girls. Which animal is the fastest land mammal? Mammal. Sorry, it's got to be cheetah. Cheetah. Yes. Yes. 
<laughs> oh, boy. I know, I don't know All right, I guys. If Marie Kondo shows up on your doorstep, what is she there to do? Tidy up. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Is that, is that like I just learned that. Right. Right. That's pretty She's close great. right there. She is yeah. This is close. Ladies, what's the name of the dangly thing at the back of your mouth? Oh. What? That thing. You know that thing back there? No, no, you 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 did it. Nice job. <laughs> All right, up. guys, in the Nintendo video game, who is Mario's brother? Luigi. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Injury, <laughs> falling apart. Yes. I smashed his head. All right. I wouldn't press it. Ladies, what are the names of the four main characters in the TV series Golden Girls? Oh, oh. my god. OK. Blanche, Rose, Dorothy, Sophia. Sophia. Yes. Yes! yes. Nice job! <laughs> <laughs> Guys in poker, what beats a straight flush? Roy flush. That's right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ladies, what's the official language of the Bahamas? <gasps> Bahamian? <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> Um, English. English. Yeah. yeah. Oh. What did you say? What did you say? Oh. Like, I didn't know. It's, it's English. So did you know? I didn't. All right. Uh, I just want to say, uh, on behalf, I hope of everyone, we have appreciated and loved you for 12 years. Y'all are amazing, and you'll go on to do other amazing things. We'll miss you. Thank you so much Thank for you. everything for 12 years.